to show you the three mo most important tips for turning. I had a request from a Susie. She wrote on comments on the YouTube videos and she wanted to know how to do it, the tips. And because turning was not my cup of tea, I struggled it and I practiced and I analyzed. Now I can show it to you guys. So if you have, if you are strong with something, just do it one thousand times and you will be professional. If you have any questions, if you want me to do something, or let me know how you get on, or any person you don't understand. I'm gonna put a one most important things bonus tip at the end of the video. So stay with me until the video finish. I'm going, I'm uploading a video once or twice a week about flamenco tutorial and about entertainment. So if you want to learn with me or if you don't want to miss my videos, please subscribe. Let's get going. Okay, so I was gonna film inside my house, but it was too small. Okay, I decided to come here. So tip number one is the preparations. When you want to turn, you don't go from here without knowing what you're gonna do. You don't do that because you will be unbalanced and it's impossible to turn with the stability. So when you decided to turn, you have to prepare to be straight up, stomach muscle and up. So I'm gonna show you the feet will be like normal, like this, okay, colocación. So, when we are here, we turn. Uno, dos, tres. Uno, dos, tres. Uno, dos, tres. This is really important. So from here, not here, when you want to turn. Uno, dos, tres. Again. Uno, dos, tres. And the tip number one, two is the brazos, the arm. We cannot turn without brazos. The arm is straight up. It's like a middle of your body. It's never like this or like that. It's here. So do you remember the, how to do the basic brazos? We go here, we come here and the center and we go up, right? Yeah, this neighbor goes like this and up. Why? It's because you will be unbalanced. It's important the stomach pain. And then the brazos, the arms, comes always the center of your body, the middle. From here and here. And this brazo will help you turn with stability so one step one we're gonna get your feet ready and arms uno dos y tres uno dos y tres uno dos y tres uno dos y tres Let's do it a little bit quicker so that we make sure that you don't fall off. Uno, dos, tres. Pam, 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 pam. And how this brazo goes, so we always have to come here, as I say, the middle. So what we, are, what we do is here, uno, dos y tres, okay? Uno, dos y tres. Otra vez. Uno, dos y tres. All together. Colocación. Your feet. Uno. Arms together. Uno, dos y tres. Uno, 
two, three, press. And you always have to imagine that you're, you're, you're pulling from the ceiling. Yeah? And the arm will help you to be more up. Here. It's not like this. It's not like, okay, let's turn. That's, that's difficult because we are not straight. We are not, we are, our stomach is not in. And when the posture is not there, then it's just easy to fall down. So imagine that someone is pulling you from the sitting or the sky. Okay, here. Yeah. So from the front, I will show you how exactly the arm goes. Uno. Do y tres. And the uno, do y tres. And this uno, do y tres is important. Of course, everything is important. Uno, do y then you have to pull it. If this pulling part is weak, then you won't. You can, but it will be more difficult to turn in time with stability. Then, this part is important, so I'm gonna do it again, again. Uno, do, y tres. Uno, do, y tres. Okay, again. So you can see my foot. Uno, do, y tres. Sorry. Uno, do, y tres. Uno, do, y tres. Uno, do, y tres. Uno, do, y tres. All right, so tip number three. What do you think is important? It's the eyes. I see a lot of people and I see myself as well. When I started, when you want to turn, you do this. It's normal, right? But when you do this, it's impossible to get it in the, bah, the point. When you do this, you will easily get fainted. Malear, no? In Spanish. So the most important, I, I think that said, everything is important, one, two, three. The important things, you have to spot one place yeah i remember when i started my friend she helped me so much of me turning because she was professional dancer as a latin and a ballet and and all sort of dance and she told me to spot 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 all the time so i have to do this spot 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 So if you have a crook or something, and you just, maybe there, you know, to the direction. Imagine that I have spot, uh, spot whatever. If you have a crook, or you can point it even. You can put mark on it. That was my life. You say spot, but how you do it? You have to leave your face until the last minute. I'm not doing this. I'm doing, my body is back, looking at back. Yeah, so my body is really facing to the back, but my face is still here. And with one, one click to come back. Do you know what I mean? Again, so if it's normal posture, then we are always with the body, right? Yeah, but when you want to turn, you can practice this one, two, three. Un, do, tre. Un, do, tre. Un, do, tre. Yeah? So what I did in the beginning, when I started, what's this? You don't do any turning. Yeah? Just walk. But leave your face into the front. Yeah? My body is in front, and my face is watching up camera. Yeah? Three. Uno, do, tre. Uno, do, tre. One, two, three. 
So the most important thing is so that you can do pirates at home, you can do a set up, but it's super important. And one of the things I used to do, and I still do, and especially when I came back from um, um, maternity leave, yeah, I use this wall, yeah? And you put yourself up, this is a wall, and this is a normal, but if, if you do normal thing, it's like that, but if you, Pull your belly up, like it's like about like a river, maybe. And then just stay there without doing this. Stay there and breathe for 30 times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten. Yeah, and it's important to do it um, against the wall because otherwise you might get, if you're not used to it, you might get um, back pain. Because I don't want this. I want straight, straight, straight. We never get like that if your back hurt, then, it, then it's doing something wrong. So, get to the wall, like that. This is really hard, you know. This is a bonus point and it's super important and anyone can do it. Let me know how you get on, especially if it's this, this because it's quite hard work. This video, I'm thinking to do a zapateado or body work or arm works. Which one would you like to see first? Because I've been doing and the tango zapateado one, two, and I'm supposed to do three. And also people interested in um, working out a body work. So write comments, please. And see you next time. Enjoy your turning practice.